Today's topic is diverticulitis. Diverticulitis is a gastrointestinal disease that is characterized by inflammation or infection of small, bulging pouches that develop along the wall of the intestine. The small, bulging pouches are called diverticula and are found often in the lower part of the colon or large intestine. However, they can develop anywhere on the digestive tract. Diverticula, which can range from small size to much larger size, forms when weak spots in the intestinal walls push out due to increased pressure on them. Diverticula themselves are harmless if they are not infected or inflamed. They typically cause no symptoms and don't need treatment as well. Diverticula are common in the Western world but are rare in Asia and Africa. They are common especially after age 50. Serious complications can result from diverticulitis. Complications such as peritonitis that happens when the inflamed pouch ruptures, allowing intestinal waste material to leak out of the intestine into the surrounding abdominal cavity. This is a serious and medical emergency and requires immediate care. Obstruction of the colon or small intestine caused by scarring. Abscess. Causes. The causes of diverticulitis are not totally understood. However, several risk factors can increase your risk of developing the condition. These may include genetics, obesity, smoking, lack of physical exercise, diet low in fiber, age, lack of vitamin D. Certain medications, such as regular use of aspirin and other non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs or NSAIDs. Symptoms. Fever. Abdominal tenderness. Nausea and vomiting. Constipation. Pain, which may persist for several days. This pain is usually felt on the right side of the abdomen, although occasionally on the left. Increased urge to urinate. Burning sensation while urinating diarrhea, blood in stool, bleeding from the rectum. Diagnosis and Treatment There are several illnesses and conditions with similar symptoms, such as irritable bowel syndrome, so your doctor will need to rule out such medical conditions that may cause your symptoms. Your doctor will ask about your symptoms, health history, and medications you take. The doctor will then carry out a physical examination, including checking your abdomen for tenderness, after which the doctor will recommend blood tests to check for anemia, inflammation, kidney or liver problems, urine test to check for infections, stool test to rule out infection in people with diarrhea, pregnancy test to rule out pregnancy in women of childbearing age, a pelvic exam to rule out gynecologic problems, CT scan, which can confirm a diagnosis of diverticulitis, as it can indicate inflamed or infected pouches. It can also indicate the severity and guide treatment. Treatment. Treatment may depend on the severity of symptoms. Mild or uncomplicated diverticulitis can be treated at home with antibiotics, over-the-counter pain reliever, such as acetaminophen, or a liquid diet for a few days while the bowel heals. With severe or complicated diverticulitis, patients may need hospitalization and treatment may include intravenous antibiotics and abscess draining if one has formed. Surgery may be recommended if you have complications and you have had several episodes of uncomplicated diverticulitis. The surgical approach consists of primary bowel resection and bowel resection with colostomy. Regular exercise, eating more fiber, and drinking plenty of water may help prevent diverticulitis. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.